Okay, you know what? I'm just saying fuck it. I'm just running at this point. If, she, if she's not coming, I ain't going after her. I've already got the key, so I'm safe. Great, I hear her, I hear her, I hear her. Run, run, where's the fuck the door? There. Let's get out of here. Camp key, camp key, camp key, go, 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 go. Just screw everything and run. Again, screw it. Screw it, I'm using a incendiary grenade. Yeah, guys, that, that must have been really boring. I apologize about that. Holy crap. Great, and I'm almost getting owned here because I'm getting so fucking nervous. <laughs> Hold on. Let me do this because Ashley needs to be healed. Yay, major fail right here. Oh, my God. I can't... I can't... Run away. <sighs> here, I'll use a hand grenade here. Die. The hell? Oh man, guys, this must be very fun for you, but it's extremely annoying for me. No, run. You know what? I'll probably just end up speeding that part up because that was just fucking ridiculous. Or better yet, that could be saved as one of my major fails. I don't even know. Screw it. I don't think there's any more enemies for the time being. Just run up here. Oh yeah, I know what we're at. We're at the uh, this part. Uh, I need to heal Ashley again, sadly. I'm using all my healing items on Ashley. That's not good. I actually have to save those. <laughs> Alright. So now, we get to shoot people! Yay! When a rail shooter, literally. If you want to know whenever you hit someone, just watch Ashley do a fist pump. <laughs> that still hit me. Okay, they're dead. Let's reload. Any more? You're supposed to use a rifle for this, but it's so much more easier with a handgun. And I think that's it. Sweet. Alright, yeah, I'm starting to recover from the shock that the fucking Bella sister gave me because I didn't want I didn't want Ashley to die. Let's get out of this. I don't know. This LP is going to suffer because of that. That's going to be one of my most boring parts of this entire LP, and I apologize for that, guys, but... I know this game's not scary, but it makes me tense because I don't want to die. Oh, well. I, I actually haven't made a fail part in the past. I usually just edit out all my failures, but I'm actually going to keep that in, probably. I don't even have to cut anything, really, to be honest, because... I already, um, like, I didn't even try to find her, really, because all I did was, uh, pretty much, uh, actually, I killed him before I could throw the dynamite. What the f- Okay? I took out the light, which kind of sucks. I need to be able to see. Alright, well, let's climb this. I think there's another person up here. Yep. Hello. He tried to perform a matrix and it failed. All right, there's nothing there. What's in here? We got the yellow cat's eye! Yay! Now I can add more junk to this beer stein. There's one more, but I don't remember where it's at. Oh well. We're about to get up to a boss, the big cheese. Hmm. Well, I already know this has been a fail recording session, but at the same time, I honestly don't give a fine shit. I am tired of that. The Bell Sisters definitely 
I've never had that problem with them. I don't know why. I always managed to kill them, but I guess one of them just got stuck or something. I mean, I heard her, but <laughs> I never saw her. Okay, screw the merchant. I'll take the shotgun shells and the rifle. We're TMP ammo. Thank you. And now we're up to a boss. I mean, I thought this recording session was good up until I got to the Bell Sisters. I thought I was going to be able to knock that out very fast, but I only killed one of them. Oh, well. Again, nothing I can do. It's pretty much the game's fault. I'm actually going to use the TMP on this, because I always use it on this boss. Come on. There we go. <clears throat> you better stay outside. Ashley, go hide. Yeah. Alright, so this is the big cheese. You just want to go ahead and start by climbing up. I'll tell you right now, this guy actually does pack a punch even with the tactical vest on. You just kind of want to move around a lot and not stay still. That's about all I can, that's all pretty much the advice I can give you. Like, see, he's right there. As long as I stay here, he can't hit me. But you do need to walk around as fast as you can. When you hear him doing that, you can shoot him. This guy actually goes down pretty fast with the TNT. Yeah, see, I've already gotten on the second phase of the fight. Okay, just back up. Just keep shooting. Yeah, still, see, yeah, he hit me, but it doesn't matter. And he's dead. Oh, I love being overpowered. So satisfying. And there we go, he's dead. Now we gotta get the false eye. Yay! Uh, take as long as you want. I'm gonna go ahead and get some of the money, uh, some of the ammo lying around here, because there's actually a lot of ammo you can pick up, so I highly recommend it. Uh, here's a green herb, shotgun shells, and okay, that's all I'm gonna get. Everything else I've pretty much got covered. Jump out! Are you yeah, I'm fine, Ashley. And there's no more items, so now we gotta backtrack all the way to, um... Uh, crap, I forget where we're even headed. I just know I gotta follow this path, <laughs> and eventually I'll be taken to where I need to be. Oh yeah, we gotta ride the... I know where we gotta go, never mind. Open the door. We're almost done with chapter two. Which I'll try not to have any more failures than I'd had that one time, but jeez, the I still can't believe the bell has just made me look like an idiot. Although it doesn't really take a lot. There's probably some stuff down there, but again, I don't give a shit. Oh well. Right there's where we're headed next, the castle. Actually probably my favorite area of the game. Either that or the island, I can't really tell you. Alright, don't worry, you don't have to shoot any more enemies on the way up. You just got to, um... Do this. Just, okay, I can't skip this. 
in a way, this kind of reminds me of Pokemon Emerald or you know Ruby or Sapphire, where you could watch uh, your player go up in the in the uh, whale cart. Okay, so now that we've done that, we can now uh, use the false eye as a thing that you would see in normal movies or whatever to open the door. Okay, I think this whole part right here is a cutscene. I don't think we control this. If we do, we just walk a little bit. Painting of the area. And the truck turns on, and you just want to kind of back up a little bit. He'll take care of the enemies for you. Have that. Wait for him. And there we go. Okay, again, back up. Don't crash. And then you want to start running, because then that's when more people will show up. So I'm just ignoring these guys. Trying to make it a little bit more like Resident Evil, you know, just trying to run away from your enemies. Well, that's not really that hard. I think if you shoot somewhere up here, you'll get the purple cat sign, and then that's for the final piece of the beer steam. I don't know, this scene, more, this scene plays out better if you do it like I just did. On the other side of the bridge. Yeah. You take that one. Okay. Ready? Okay, and that is the end of chapter three, guys. In the next part, we will be taking on the castle and meeting our next major villain that is not the big cheese. So, I will see you guys then. Bye-bye.